So the problem I had getting the cylinder head off was these studs had swollen, or four of them had had, because water can track down because there's no protection on top of the cylinder. And over the years it's just got wet, it's all leached down and these studs have swelled up. And they've also swelled into the head, into the cylinder block as well, which means it was a bit of a problem getting them out. And as you can see they're all chewy chewy. So I've got some EN16T and we'll make some new ones. Good chamfer on. Now the bottom thread needs to be three eighths UNF. So I'm having a bit of a nightmare. I managed to do the UNF, easy enough, that went on straight away, but 16 TPI UNC, which is that, is a little bit deeper. And with this being EN 16T, it's pretty tough, and I'm not having any joy with the die doing it. So my plan is to single point cut to a certain depth, and then go out, go through it with the die. Reason being, I've, this is the only um, screw cutting tip I've got, and if I damage this and I'm crap at grinding, I'm buggered. So. We'll screw cut to about halfway and then we'll run through it with a die. Let's see how we get on. Sixteen, not a loop.
it's a bit tight, but it's going on easier, which is good. And it has to work once. try that. Annoyingly I can only find a 3x UNC lock nut. But that's gone on nicely. Happy with that. Right, three to go. One eternity later. And there we have four new studs made. I did make five, but I've lost one somewhere, so I had to make another one. Which is a bit confusing. Um school day with this stuff in 16t bit tough hate threading it hate working with it i would i don't want to do it again but it's got me out of a bind because these things are like rocking horse poo thanks for watching <laughs>